With the presidential election exactly one week away, post office managers in Colorado Springs are giving us an inside look at some of the safety precautions taken when you mail off that ballot. KRDO News Channel 13's Alexis Dominguez joins us live from the newsroom with that story. Alexis. Bart, this year more than 430,000 ballots were mailed in El Paso County. As of today, it's too late to mail them, but the post office is still working hard to make sure any ballot already in the mail is counted. In the push to keep your ballot safe. There, there's a lot of steps in the process to make sure that um, we're doing things in a fair, transparent, accurate way. We're doing it in a secure way. Three plastic tubs full of mail-in ballots were hand-delivered by the U.S. Postal Service Tuesday to voting officials with the El Paso County Clerk's Office. You can see we just added today like 1,600 pieces to our um, daily mail volume, which is just a small percentage of what we, what we do every day. There's a process. These two ballot runners will sign to acknowledge they are accepting these ballots. Then they safely place them into a bag Put the sheet in. and seal them to verify they're not opened until they're being counted. And to make certain ballots are getting counted, Colorado Springs Postmaster Jolie Quintana says they're going the extra mile, collecting mail on Sunday. And we will be um, isolating those ballots on Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday to make sure they're in the hands of the county at 7 p.m. Their message ringing loud and clear Tuesday that if you vote by mail, it's their privilege to guarantee your vote makes it in on time. It's not advised to wait until the last minute to send your ballot. Many of you still will. You have until November 3rd to find a drop box or vote in person. Reporting live from our newsroom, Alexis Dominguez, Cardio News Channel 13.